What's up guys, it's me, your badass host, Draven, and welcome to another episode of our Pokemon Yellow Walker, right here on our Gym Leader Draven channel. Yes and yes, it's me, it's me, it's GLD. Let's do this, guys. So, in our last three episodes, we actually defeated the Elite Four members, uh, Lorelai, mm-hmm, Bruno, yeah, and Agatha, yeah, she was kind of scary. So now, it is finally time to take on the final member of the Elite Four, and, uh, you know, I'm gonna... I'm gonna take a chance right here. I'm gonna go with Sparky first because I have a feeling that, you know, some something crazy is gonna go on. So, here it is. You can hear it. It's just, yeah, it's just intense because you know this is the last member of the Elite Four and you know he's he's in for business. And just to make things clear, boom, you can't escape. You can't move anywhere. So, yeah. This is going to be scary right here. And here he is, Lance in all his glory. Ah, I heard about you, Draven. I lead the Elite Four. You can call me Lance, the Dragon Trainer. You know that dragons are mythical Pokemon. They're hard to catch and hard, and hard to raise, but their powers are superior. They're virtually indestructible. I beg to differ. You know, just wait, uh, just wait 20 years. Just wait 20 years. Well, are you ready to lose? Your League Challenge ends with me, Draven. So guys, it's been a good one. Here it is. Quite possibly the last battle we'll ever do. Maybe. I don't know. But yes, it's against Lance the Dragon type trainer and, well, it is what it is. This is a big battle right here. You can listen to the gym battle right here. BAM! Lance wants to fight. He comes out with Gyarados. Very, very powerful Pokemon. And here's Sparky. So going into our second screen right here, red, blue, and yellow. Basically the same thing except different sprites. Lance likes to use, eh, he likes to use uh, two different kinds of uh, Dragonairs with different kinds of movesets. No, actually the same kind of movesets. Same levels and all that stuff. The thing you have to worry about the most is that Hyper Beam. It is a very, very powerful move, especially in this game right here. It is the most powerful move. Um, also, the best way to beat most of these Pokemon is through a rock type because they are, well, let's see, one, two, three, three out of the five Pokemon are, are rock or are flying type Pokemon. The other thing too, just be aware of those status moves, those status moves that they like to use. In Pokemon Yellow, the dra both Dragoners are a little bit different. One has electric type moveset and the other has a water and ice type moveset, so just be aware of what you're about to face. Here we go, into the next screen. Thunder attack for it, and uh, wow. And uh, that, yeah, we both missed. Come on. There we go. What are the odds? And will you go down? He will go down. Bye bye. Sparky is kicking some butt right here, and Dragonair's coming out first. So, I'm gonna go with Hydra just because, hey, I do have an ice type move that can beat you. I'm just saying. I've been waiting for this for a long time. Ice type moves will work against Dragon type Pokemon. And would you look at that? Easy, so easy, it beats you. And she's she's gonna come out with another Dragon here, so I'm just gonna stick by with my Hydra right here. And Ice Beam again for the win. And would you look at that? Two easy victories right there. Nothing too hard, and she, he's gonna come out with an Aerodactyl. So what I'm gonna do right now is I'm only I'm gonna be switching it up right here. I'm gonna go with Thrasher, mainly because it knows Surf, and it won't be so affected by Aerodactyl. The only downside to this is that Aerodactyl is faster than my Pokemon, and that Wing Attack will hit us. And here we go with a Surf Attack, hopefully for the win. Oh yeah. You gotta love that. Oh, come on! You should have lost right there. Go again, and that swift attack will do some kind of damage right there. And it was a critical hit, but here we go with another surf attack. Hopefully this will be the end of an Aerodactyl. And that is how you beat Aerodactyl. Look at that. And here he comes out with his Dragonite. So, I'm gonna go with Tank right here. I haven't used Tank in a while, but this is how it's going to be. Tank versus Dragonite. The thing you have to worry about this Dragonite is it's at level 62. In Pokemon Yellow, it does have Blizzard, Fire Blast, Thunder, and Hyper Beam. Four of the most powerful moves. 
sometimes very inaccurate, but it is at level 62 and it is very fast. Luckily for me, I do have a blizzard attack waiting for him. This guy right here is going to try and beat me with all these, with brute force, basically. And that took a lot, and I missed, so I'm going to go again. And he's, wow, he's using every single move in his arsenal right here. You know, just playing this back in the day, it was really, really hard to beat this guy. And wow. Wow, I just sent him out there for, for a loss. So I'm going to go with Thrasher right here. Let's go. Okay. Let's go. I'm going to go with Thrash Attack. There we go. And that Blizzard Attack will hit us. So I'm basically doing this for dramatic effect. I know that I can beat him with, a, with one Pokemon right here. And that right there takes us out. Ultra Psycho is coming out for hopefully a win right here. So let's go with that Psychic Attack. Two of the most powerful Pokemon in this game going at it, and that takes a lot. And here comes that Blizzard Attack. Oh jeez. Oh jeez. Stay. Stay. There we go. So we go with the Psy Beam right here. And that takes care of everything. Say goodbye to Dragonite. Ultra Psycho, level 59. How you doing? And as you can see... Lance is not too happy. He's like, that's it. I hate to admit it, but you're a Pokemon master. Really? He's like, I still can't believe my dragon's lost to you, Raven. You are now the Pokemon League champion. Or you would have been, but you have one more challenge ahead. You have to face another trainer. His name is Gary. He beat the Elite Four before you. He is the real Pokemon League champion. So guys, this is it. You, the matchup that we've been waiting for for quite some time. If you remember, you know, if you remember, it's just been up and down. Our very first battle against Gary was not successful, but right here, this is going to be it. For all the marbles, we're going to be facing Gary for the final time. So stay tuned. The next episode will be very, very interesting. See you guys.